YouTube, what's good, YouTube? What is going on? What is happening, man? Of course, it's your guy one more time, Deirdre L. Higgs Jr., and we are indeed back with yet another fragrance video. Okay, so typically I don't uh, record this late, but I, I wanted to get in front of a camera. I just got a package that I was uh, very much so eagerly, eagerly anticipating uh, for it to come in. Okay, so my video, my moods and my videos are not like this, you know, the lighting is all different and I'm a, I guess I'm a, a creative junkie, so I notice it, but anyway, that's, that's my personal dig. Some of y'all don't care, y'all just wanna watch the video, so let's do that. So this video is inspired by, um, a couple of weeks ago, I saw a random YouTube video, and you know how it is, sometimes you're watching something and you might get busy and walk out the room and YouTube is still playing. Well, of course, fragrances is in my algorithm on YouTube, and I can't remember the the YouTuber who were talking who was talking about it, but I do remember the reaction to his face when um, he was reviewing one of these fragrances. So, for all my Killian fans out there, all my Killian fans, I have something here that maybe some people who want to get into Killian and don't want to spend that kind of a amount of money for a fragrance or if you do have Killian you might be looking for something to preserve um, what you have um, by getting a clone or inspired by and that's what we have today so the house of uh, Paris corner uh, the Emir line have came out with these uh, Killian clone fragrance of some of the most popular ones that they have and all of this was inspired by this one now this listen to this name if you haven't heard of it this is from the house of Paris corner the Amir line. This is called When Souls Get High. Get high. So this is what this video is inspired by because I got this one, I smelled it, and it blew my mind. And that inspired me to get the other two in the line that are out there. So I have this package that I just got today. We're going to open this up live. But I'm going to go ahead and get this on the tester strip and just kind of walk y'all through and I don't even have to do that because the the uh, the the fragrance is just spilling on the atomizer. But let's get this on a, a tester. Two get sprays, and this is elite cloning or inspired by at its finest. All right, so when souls get high, man, honey, honey, cherry tobacco nuttiness uh, vanilla it's just a very sweet and gourmand treat and and for all my gourmand lovers out there this is a phenomenal phenomenal sense and what this is inspired by cloning um i think it's called back to black so when souls get high is uh yeah back to black all right honey tobacco almond vanilla and woody notes uh, is what the breakdown is. But when I smelled this, I lost my mind. Now, I've never smelled Killian's Back to Black. I never smelled it. And I, like I said uh, a couple of videos ago, at this point in my fragrance journey, if I smell a clone first and it smells fantastic, I'm good. Like, I'm good. I'm just, I'm into what smells good and of course what's gonna add some variety to my collection. Now, would I like to smell the, the original DNA? yeah of course and i'm sure that i will one day but this stuff is fantastic so beautiful gourmand fragrance i'll get into a more full review of this one and all the others but this video is inspired by paris corners when souls get high from the amir line all right so let's go ahead and get the package open and let's see what we have uh today and uh, try to keep this video as short as possible. I'm not gonna do no real crazy breakdown. This is a true first impression, but I, like I said, I got this in and I just wanted to uh, jump right into it, man. And uh, I said, well, why not turn on the camera and let the Smell Good family know what's going on? And like I said, I typically don't record this late, but whatever, bro, <laughs> this calls for it. All right, so uh, we're gonna pull the package out. They wrapped it uh, up pretty good. And, uh, you know, as I open this up, man, it's, you know, 
A lot of people might not be into gourmands. A lot of probably men, but I am. Um, I love a great gourmand fragrance, and I was really blown away by when souls get high because I do love the note of honey, and honey is like super, super present uh, in that uh, fragrance. It smells tremendous, and it's unisex. So any ladies out there who are watching it is definitely a unisex, unisex style of a fragrance. All right. Now uh, let's go ahead and see which one we're going to go. All right, so let's go with this one, man. Uh, from the House of Paris Corner, from the Amir line, we have uh, Fire, Fire Your Desire. Fire Your Desire, there's the casing on it. Um, and at the top it says uh, Shades of, okay, so this is a series, Shades of Dark series. That's what this stuff, uh, this line is called. All right, so let's go ahead and pop this one open. And I believe this one is inspired by Killian's Angel Shed. So all my Latafa uh, uh, Kamra uh, fans out there, you might want to pay attention to this because Kamra is um, a beautiful fragrance. One of the top fragrances that I personally have acquired this year. But even though it has a minor, I ain't gonna say minor, slight similarities, to Killian's Angel Share, it definitely does its own thing, all right? All right, so here we go, beautiful bottle, just like uh, when when souls get hot. Here we are, fire, your desire, beautiful bottle. These Middle Eastern bottles, they just do a fantastic job. They got this plate on here, Amir 100 ml at a parfum, fire, desire, 3.4 ounce. Let's go ahead and get into what this smells like. And again, this is supposed to be a Killian's Angel Share uh, clone. Let me give me another test strip here. And uh, let's see what we got. All right. Two sprays, pretty good. Let's see what we got, man. Yep. <laughs> yep. Now this is boozy. This is boozy for sure. This is boozy. Yeah, but it smells really good. It's boozy. You got little spices in here as well. I'm gonna go ahead and look this one up real quick because I'm curious. Um, so what is what uh, with this? So with Fire Your Desire, Cognac, Tonka Bean, I'm about to say you definitely get some cinnamon in here. Some oak, some vanilla, some praline, and some sandalwood, okay? Now this this is a little bit closer to Killian's Angel Share, not quite. It's good. I'm not sure it's better than Cambra. I'm not sure that it is, but I am testing it on paper and not on skin. So I'm going to be fair and wait till I get it on skin and see where we at. But I do like this. It definitely it definitely has a booziness to it. Some cinnamon for sure. Some sweetness in here as well. This is pretty good. Yeah, this is pretty good. I like it. I like it. I think it's solid. Um, just off the first sniff off paper. But of course, I got to get more into it. So, uh, Paris Corners Amir Fire Your Desire. Um, really good fragrance. Our first impressions. Of course, I'm going to wear it and see what it is really all about. But it is supposed to be somewhere in the neighborhood of Killian's Angel Share. But yeah, that stuff is all right. It's all right for sure. It's all right. All right, so let's go ahead and move along to the last one from the, uh, uh, yeah, let's see, the uh, Paris Corner, a mirror line from the Shades of Darkness series. It has a really wild name, this one. This one is called, and I'm going to show the bottle off once I get this plastic. This one is called Your Drug. <laughs> There's the uh, presentation there. Your Drug from the Amir line. Very interesting names. I'm like, wow, how did they come up with this? Very similar bottle presentation, like Fire Your Desire. All right, and let's get that off. So, yeah, Your Drug. Very dark, very dark juice here. This is the one I was most interested in. The Your Drug was the one I was most interested in. I happened to see Fire Your Desire, and it said Killian, Killian Angel Share Clone. 
I say why not, man? It'd be some good material to put up against Kamara and things like that, all right? Especially with this time of year we, we're in, with this cooler and it's colder out, all right? So let's go ahead and get to your drug. I'm gonna go ahead and pull it up so I'll have it ready. Um, but it is inspiring another Killian fragrance, and this one is inspired by Intoxicated. Killian's Intoxicated. So let's also get this on paper. And let's see what we got. All right, so two sprays. Atomizers are just the same. I'm going to spray that and fill out on the phone. So let's see what we get with your drug. Okay, wow. This is... Man, you get some nutmeg in here. A little coffee. A little spice in there as well. But this smells good. Oh yeah, this smells good. I like this. Yes, I, I out of the out of this and fire your desires, the angel share clone. I like the your drug the best. I don't know if I like it better than I think when your when souls get high is the, the the one out of the three for me. But I gotta test all these out. But first sniff, this is good. I like this. You're drugged. <laughs> what are you wearing tonight, bro? You're drugged. <laughs> but yeah, wow. I'm really impressed with this. Now, I've never smelled, um, uh, what is it called by Killian? I don't uh, never smelled intoxicated. I've never smelled, I think it's black to back, black or whatever it's called by the other one, but I have smelled angel share before. All right, but, um, yeah, this is good. A slight coffee note, the nutmeg, cinnamon starting to creep out there. Yeah, very nice fragrance. This is very, this is definitely for me. This is something I wear on date night. All three of these are date night for sure. But it's good. It's good. All right. So I just want to hop on the camera and do like a first initial uh, smell, um, uh, smell test of my three new fragrances from Paris Corner, the Amir line. So once again, this was the video that sparked it all. Uh, this is called When Souls Get High. All right, beautiful bottle there. When Souls Get High. And then inspired me to pick up your drugged. Love these bottles. Bottles are very nice. Heavy bottles. The cap don't go in places, kind of snuggled up there. Definitely wouldn't recommend holding it from the cap. Um, but uh, you'll be taking the risk. And then, of course, you have Fire Your Desire fire your desire all right so three excellent fragrances i paid around 50 dollars for each one of these off of uh amazon amazon but you can get them from all over just google it i'll put the links down below where you can get them around that 45 to 60 dollar price range they kind of fluctuating of course the time that we are in so i just wanted to hop on camera real quick man and really put this out there for sure these are really really good fragrances especially for this time of year all my killian fans out there Either you don't want to spend the money for a bottle of Killian, which I understand, or you want to preserve what you have from Killian, which I understand too. You should definitely check out these three fragrances. Uh, four reviews, more extensive reviews are coming for all three. Links will be down in the description if you want to check any of them out. Haven't really seen too many people talking about any of these, except that one YouTuber who was talking about when souls get high, and he convinced me. All right, maybe somebody out there might be convinced by just this quick little uh video all right so until next time y'all be cool be safe take care of yourself i'm about to go shower and i'm about to go to bed all right because like i said i usually don't record this late but it is what it is all right smell good family y'all be cool oh, oh you thought it was over didn't you splack her up sleepy and all splack splack don't play